Hello Lilas, welcome back to my channel guys. I'm here to do a quick quick video of Baby Bryson. Um, I just wanted to come on and to talk to you guys about him. Guys, if you're not subscribed to this channel, please make sure you go ahead and subscribe. So, um, as I said before, I was going to go in and I wanted to add more Motlin to his head because I had thought about selling him. So I didn't want to sell him without his head model if I was gonna sell him ball. So I decided to go in and do that before I touch up shine spots. But instead I ended up going in and just adding more skin tone to him and everything. So I did end up doing that, I did end up you know, making sure that he had some modeling in his head. Um, I changed his lip color a little bit. Um, I did some more stuff like just all over. Um, so he has um, just a few more layers of skin tone as well as some of his details. But in the process, of course, when I rematted him, I created shine spots. Um, that I have to go in and touch up as well, but um, I just I, I I I can't I couldn't focus on that because I has I have so much other stuff to do, and I was just like I'm just gonna put it aside until I can you know really work on him some more, and as far as his shine spots and stuff go. Now I purposely glossed over the front of his. I, on his eyelids but I don't know that I necessarily like it so to speak so that may change a little bit but he don't have any eyelashes right now either because of course I pulled those out which I didn't particularly like those anyway I was going to redo it anyway so he always had like mottling and stuff in his like thigh area and stuff like that you know just where babies would be a little bit more you know red and stuff but I, I deepen that, of course, because his color got deeper. Um, but I just, I don't seem to be able to capture it as well on camera. Because he's still light. But um, he just have a little bit more color. So he's like more closer to um, a very light biracial versus just being you know a Caucasian baby so that's what he ended up turning out to be this is it um but I wanted to show you I also went ahead and put him on the my custom body because I wanted to also see how that was gonna work I want to make sure, and I did make sure the bodies are the same as the ones that they come with. So, I did do that. Oh, and I did do more to his fingernails as well. Like, I didn't like how basic his fingernails was and, you know, his knuckles and stuff like that. So, I actually did add quite a bit of little stuff. Um... And I darkened his heel just a little bit. So, like I said, I don't know why, but for whatever reason, on camera, it doesn't show like it's that much a difference. I don't know if you guys can tell how much of a difference it is, but it is. And, which makes me really torn on, like, should I just, you know, I don't know what how, how I feel about it. I really want to. I don't know. I just probably just need to take a pause with this one. Um, I'm going to root him. And I think I'm going to root him with some medium brown curly hair. Right, baby? Or wavy hair or whatever. But he's just so cute. And um, his little legs actually wrinkles. Like down in this area, It when it's... You know, when he's curled up like that, you can see, like, the wrinkles in his legs. And the thing what I learned, too, about the babies, as they have more color, seem like you can see the wrinkles more. 
um, sometime. I don't know. But anyway, that is him. Um, I didn't. I should have took his, showed you guys his body. But he has on a dose weight body. It's not to match his color. He smells so good. <laughs> I basically transferred all his stuff over to him, and he just smells so good. And he's just so cute like this. Like, I almost, like, I was like, you know what? That was another reason. I was like, even if I don't sell him, once I get all his shine spots gone, he, like, I really can just look at him bald and, and be okay. I really, I really, really love this baby. Um, and it's kind of crazy. It's like, well, why do you want to sell him? Like, I don't know if you guys, let me see if you guys can see. In, if you guys can see how it wrinkles I don't know can you guys see that I don't know but I just thought I would share that so what I did decide to do is put um, Ruby next to him and if you guys remember before when I put Ruby next to him it was like so night and day but now she doesn't stand off as much and his color is not as don't seem to be as much lighter see now that he has some color they're not that bad I mean he's definitely lighter than her Let's see if I can move this over a little bit so if you see her now, like before, he looked so pale up against her and she looked so much darker. But now she doesn't look as much darker next to him because he has skin tone. He has, he has more skin tone. So I did make a change on him. Um, also in his cheeks, I think I made him a little bit more natural. So his milk, milk butt bumps not milk bumps, <laughs> his little baby acne looks more natural now because before it was just the acne and it was just kind of like jumping off of his face. But now that he has um, more skin tone, it's not just jumping off. See, he has more redness around it. It doesn't jump off the page. Damn. I'm going to leave him on this. You would think I learned by putting, I probably shouldn't put this on, on him. I just thought about it when the last time the, the ink rubbed off on, not the ink, but the dye rubbed off on him, but I think he'll look good in the darker color though. I don't know. Should you put that on? Will you be okay if I put you on that? <laughs> I don't know. But yeah. Oh, I think he will be so cute in this. I may actually have to do it. But yeah, another way, I didn't really do a lot to like the, like his, uh, too much to like the color here. So if you put this color against there, let me see if I can, if I can see. It's, um, like you can see the difference there. Or like his hand against his face it's a little bit lighter so that's how you go and then you can look from the the palm to the, the wrist let's see like that sometimes you can see the color difference but nevertheless he's and i deepened his belly button to match his lips and stuff so his his little details all blended but i i i don't know i think i'm gonna have to just stick to painting babies specifically to sell because when it comes to my personal babies I just lately I just seem like I just cannot let go of the ones that I've fully bonded with and got attached to that's what I think is happening now I think that I've gotten to a point where I have to go in and saying I'm painting this baby to sell and put that baby up for sale because when I put my personal babies up for sale, it just don't never work out. 
because I always take them right back down. Um, Ruby, I have, like I said, another one. So, I love Ruby, but I will still sell Ruby. I guess I would sell both if, if I, if the right opportunity presents itself, but I guess I'm just not in a rush to sell them. But I think, um, I don't know. I think he's going to be really cute when he gets his hair. That's what I think. I think he's going to, that's what's going to really... There we go. But I'm, I'm, I am glad. I love the color that he was, but I do like this color um, as well. I think I kind of almost like it a little bit more. It gives him just a little bit more color. There we go. But I loved him both ways. But I, I, I just felt like I needed to give him more, a little bit more detail. No, you see? <laughs> Ruby's like, yeah, I got this little hat and little outfit for her the other day. She's still, look, she's up for sale and still getting clothes. Um, only because I know I will get another baby her size. So I'm not worried about it as much. But, um, yeah, so that's him, guys. Um... And I, like I said, I just wanted to share that part with you guys that he did get some changes, but he still got to get all the shine spots. And it's just, I don't know why. I normally don't have that many shine spots afterwards, but um, I think that's why I've slowed down on my custom babies. And I'm not moving at a, such a fast speed because I think I... Um, I'm working myself too much, too hard, and I don't want to be tired while I'm working on other people's babies, but that is him. And so I think you guys should be able to see that he does have more color now from the contrast of the two versus his previous pictures and stuff like that but I really love his lip color I, I don't know I just love him so I, I'm excited I'm glad I'm glad that I did make the, the the few subtle changes and I think he is um he's still gonna be a really good sweetheart once I play with him and dress him and put on the right clothing and stuff like that but anyway that is it guys thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed the video and we will see you the next time